All right. Well, welcome back, everybody, to Dinkum. This is Dinkum with Ariel. This is episode 68, I believe. Uh, let's just check my backpack. I believe I wreaked a little bit of havoc out among the palm trees. So I threw some of that palm wood away. Well, okay, let's throw it into storage. Let's not chuck it away. I can hear the rain. Guess what? I know. Wow, look at this. We don't need to worry about watering today. We're going to just go check our chickens. See how they're enjoying the extra space they've got. I don't think they've found it yet, but I'm sure they will because they are chickens. All right, let's go check the wombats. See how they're enjoying the extra space they've got. I think they're pretty happy down here with the extra food. Uh, we'll just stab a few Billy's buttons and I will uh, plant them in other places. Wow, don't these girls look happy? Yes. Alright. Oh, my bottle brush is ready. Let's go with that. Oh, no, wait. Doesn't that, that means we do have to um, actually do a little bit of harvesting. And a little bit of cutting down and replanting. Oh my gosh, never rains but it pours. And look at the weather. It is certainly pouring today. That's where you went. You sneaky fruit. I know, next game I play I'm going to have a much better idea of where I want to put things. Okay. So we have one, two, three, four rows. Oh no, that's not good. Uh, did you just fall over? No, you did not. Alright, no, my mouse went out of the thing. That's fine. Oh no, I got no seeds out of that one. Only one out of that one. Oh, that's not good. Like I said, it's a gamble as to whether or not you're going to get the seeds you need. Oh gosh. Okay, that one got me too. I think I'm breaking even at the moment. Oh dear. Alright, that one got me too. Alright, there's one that I thought I missed earlier. Almost scared to look to see my seed tallies, but we'll, the truth will come out once we um, get this done. I think we're we're actually ahead. A little bit, not much. Let's see if we're anywhere close to five rows. I know I'm going to break a shovel the way I'm going. That's probably not a bad thing. Let's um, grab our inventory, grab our seeds. Yes, we are ahead. Oh, I may have to run inside for another axe the way the way things are, but that's fine. We are nearly at the end of having to do this every time they flower. Nearly.
I am assuming that I can fit 10 plants in a row. I may actually be slightly less, so uh, let's we'll see. Could be more too, we'll find out. No, put my shovel instead of my, my plant. Uh, we were supposed to. We were supposed to fang out on some of this. Let's, um, let's grab this. Okay, we're good. Oh man, that's a face full of pavlova. That is awesome. Alright, now we should be fine. All our energy needs should be well and truly met. Oh dear. I know, egg and sugar, man. That is pavlova. Egg white, sugar. Fruit, so you get the fruit, fruit sugars as well. Sweetened cream, because there's not enough sugar in the egg white. But it does look like our gamble paid off and we're actually going to get a fairly good crop of bottle brushes out of it. I am so looking forward to seeing how this how this looks when we're finished. this and that is so good Oh, look at that. So next next time we, we do this, next harvest, I reckon we're going to have enough to finish out, probably finish out the, um, the thing and maybe have enough to actually add to town beautification on top of it, which is the next step, uh, I guess. Worth it. So we're going to be able to have body brushes all around town on top of everything else. My shovel is about to go spring. Oops. Alright, that's it. Yeah, I think so. We'll, we'll have, if we don't, we'll be very, very close. Now, did I not have uh, limes on board? Yeah, I did. I had some. Let's, uh, let's drop those in into their space. So that this is properly finished. All right, they're all done. Ooh. Okay, so the next thing we want to do, the next, the next thing we just, we do want to get rid of these, or rather harvest them. I know, I don't want to know where they went. We do want to get all of these off. So that we don't forget. Yeah, 
feet off me. I know I haven't sheared them yet, so hopefully they're going to be okay. Radio. Uh, oh, I'll grab some of that. Right, so that's all done. That is definitely all done. Okay, so we've pretty much got all of that done. We now need to go plant our hardwood stand. And we're going to do a half and half, half hardwood and half um, half not hardwood. So I'm just going to grab this, drop that in there. Whew. I know, I'm going to have to go get my other shovel in a minute. But that's fine because I'm also going to have to... Um, offload some of the stuff that I've been picking up so that's it'll work I just might get this bit done first if we can so all along here just we got a stack of hardwood off just a couple of rows Again. Alrighty, I guess we're going to empty our pockets. So now, now we've actually got most of our manufacturing, um, not our manufacturing, most of our growing side of things done. I'm going to go harvest the quandongs. We'll have to get a move on with that shortly. That's, and that can go, and that can go. Oops, that egg can go as well. And I think I had some milk in here, didn't I? No, I don't. I thought I did. Hmm. Alright, that's fine. Let's get these seeds away. Oh, well, not the seeds, the flowers away. Um, I might put the quandongs in here as well. They're kind of a seed. Put the bush seed away. Uh, I might grab out the grass seeds and keep them because we're going we're gonna to be digging up a few more of them, so that's fine. Let's get the. Um, oh, no, that doesn't go in there. The feather away. The poop needs to go back in this barrel, I believe. All right, now we're looking a little bit better. It's 2.21 p.m. I might make a quick trip into town to um, just pick up that. Quick trip to town. I'll just go over here, see if we've got any crops. Oh my gosh, we do. Make the most of our, har our tomato harvest while we can. Must be getting close to autumn, right? Wow, look at all of this. 
Away we go. Man, I hate to think of how many tomatoes that is. Actually, I don't hate to think of it. I think that's going to be entertaining as anything. I think I saw some beans ready to rock. Just run along the edge here, see if they're all done. It's nice to not have to water them uh, as well. We should also see if we can pick up our, speaking of watering, our sprinkling thing off uh, Fletch right after we sell a bunch of stuff to John. Hi John. Uh, well, I want to sell you a bunch of stuff. Yeah, I want to sell you that Harlequin and the bees and is that it? Yeah, that's the bit. That's it. A bunch of stuff. Well, my bad. Thank you. Uh, did we have in our chores any? Hunt five animals, grind two stones, and craft a new tool. Radio. Uh, I'm about to break a shovel. Let's um, let's pick up a shovel while we're here. That's a shovel. It's a big spoon for dirt and stuff. Yep, I will take that. Thank you so much, John. Okay. We're gonna drop in next door to Fletcher's while she's still there. Hi, Fletch. Hey, Area Blue. Well, I I'd like to apply for a license. All right then. Uh, Scafetti. Irrigation license, thank you. Ooh, an advanced sprinkler. Alright, I've only got 470 points left. I don't think that's enough for anything. So, agricultural vehicle license. I was going to say our next most cheapest would be that, but I'm thinking this is this is the cat's bananas. We've got to grab this one. Next. Alrighty, you and me, Croco. I was just saying, he's wising up to me, this crocodile. Oh, wait. I know, I've spun off the- I've spun off what I need to. Right. I know, no more terrorising the townsfolk. What have we told you about that? Pretty sure there's something interesting in there. We'll have a look at it in a minute. Okay. Whew. Uh, okay, I think I need to buy another food bowl. We'll just buy that. Yep, I'll take it. Brilliant. We, well, we need it. We need more animal feeders, so that's fine. That was... I know, another... What what furniture did I just pick up? Stylish dresser, a bunk bed, and a rattan cabinet. Ooh. Well, let's go this way. We'll see if we can fit anything in our rattan cabinet. And I'm thinking maybe a stylish bunk bed for over here, because I'm thinking I'm still on my sleeping bag. Um, you know... We, we should probably fix that. There's another Harlequin. Uh, radio. I know, where am I going to put stuff? Let me, um, pick that up. Oh, seriously. It's so irritating. <sighs> Sigh. Okay, my pockets are full. The tomatoes are not going to fit. Well, actually, let's see what is going to fit in here. So we have the green beans. Yeah, the tomatoes are not going to fit. I'm going to start transferring my food over into the seed thing, so we'll put the tomatoes in here. And I think I've still got sugar or something in my bag, don't I? No, I managed to get that into here? No, I didn't. Where is it? I may have dumped it somewhere. Ah, oh, inconvenient. Put that away. Put that away. Alright, that's now full. Let us... Drop away those and the quandongs. 
Alrighty, over here we need to put away our crocodile tooth, our bones. That's that's pretty much that. Alright. Um alright, I wanna pick up my can I pick up this now? Yeah, pick it up. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking my bunk bed's gonna look perfect just here. Where are they? Let's grab that stylish dresser. So there's my bunk bed. I, I'm gonna want to put the stylish dresser down as well. Just move the grass seeds out of there. So let's go with the bunk bed. Uh, I want to put it kind of here. This may be. Uh, not there. Man. I oh, know. I want to rotate it. There we go. Nice. All right. So now I get somewhere to sleep. That's not. You know, a sleeping bag on the floor. Finally, this poor character. Hopefully the stylish dresser will, will suit the place. Ooh. Alrighty, I'll be in that. Let's um let's place that down. Can I fit stuff in it? No, see this is this is the other reason why I keep thinking that you can't put stuff inside stuff. Oh, sigh. Let's have a look. I've got a rattan, maybe the rattan cabinet will do me better. Let's uh, let's see what that looks like on this side. Okay, that looks promising. Um, let's pick up the stylish dresser and we'll put the rattan cabinet down here. That looks like the front of it. Oh, no, that looks kind of much nicer than the stylish dresser. Can I fit stuff in it? No, that's annoying. I mean, why else do I want it? <laughs> uh, um, I know, right? I know, let's put the stylish dresser down over here. And actually, why don't I check and, and look at the furniture in... It's going to be a bit of a mismatch, and I can I can spruce things up properly later. But uh, let's see, we've got Nordic couch, Nordic lamp, Nordic seat, dark wooden seat, dainty coffee table, eastern lamp, dainty bed, eastern couch, wooden couch, dark wooden chair, white dinner table, white coffee table, pink table, dainty bedside table, green lamp, stylish sofa, and a green cabinet. I oh, know, I need a house. I need to change my house a little bit. Alright, I've got Rue plush, a dark wooden table, and a dainty coffee table. Over here. I oh, know, everything needs to... I need to be able to pick up all of these boxes and put them... put their contents somewhere. Alright, but that has given me some more space. Let's go drop off this mining helmet and the... Um, and the chicken feed dish because basically why are you daft chickens out in the rain we're gonna put this here and uh, we're gonna grab all of this and drop it down there sorry fern uh and we're gonna fill up everything that's empty i'd like to be able to put the, the feed dishes under somewhere covered so i know the feed isn't getting soaked through but uh that's okay minor minor concerns Alright, it looks like the chickens have adapted to uh, to where their new home is. We got this. There we go. Alright, I did not get my plantain mu done much, did I? My plantain. My planting. My plantation. Oh yeah, let's drop that in there and that in there. Aww. Now they're looking a little happy. If someone is not sleeping in their shed though, or they're sharing someone else's shed, that does happen. Yeah, look, look at this. What are you doing, Fazetta? You're just going to stay out in the rain, aren't you? Stop on little wombat. Rightio, let's get the grass seed down. I'm just going to start from the front, and when, when that's all done, we'll get the, the back done. So, hopefully... Wait, what's that? That's a fern seed? That's not grass. Radio. Alright, so the wombats are done. Uh, I do want to get that harvest in, so we'll uh, we'll do that in a minute. But I think it's time for this little character. Oh my gosh. She's not going to know what's hit her to get some sleep. We will sleep until tomorrow. We'll do another day. I think she's pretty happy with that. 
Well, farming went up, didn't it? So we haven't maxed out our skills yet. Time to get up, you. Oh, that's right. We want to also put our bees in that space. What's that? Is that a new... No, see, I know there's a new bug in town. I just haven't found it yet. Oh, gosh. Did I miss these yesterday? Or did they just... You know, maybe they're late bloomers. We need tomato soup. Tomato soup would be a really good recipe addition. And, and you know, tomato and cream, because you need the, the creamy kind of side of things, the rich milk, to um, to cut the tomato side of things. Now, okay, plantation time. Let's finish off this tree plantation. I know, we're being very single-minded here because we would really... Oh, what did I do? Did I just bury that on a glass seat? That was my shovel. Well, fine. Now I need to go get another shovel full of dirt from somewhere because I can just magic this stuff up, right? many rows have we got now? One, two, three, four, and then there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think we want ten trees in each row. That would be probably the best idea. So I want to expand each of these rows then. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep, yeah, I want to expand each of these rows by one. And that will mean that we'll have 50 of these trees planted when we have five rows complete. All right, that's all of that. So I am what? One, two, five, one, two, three, four, five, ten, ten trees short of my goal. Let's, uh, let's, let's make it no trees short. We'll grab some of these. What? Oh, that's kind of nice to know. All right, so we've got all of this down. That's six. I need four more, so chop down two more trees. Wow. All right, no beehives today. They seem to come down a lot in the gum trees. Let's uh, let's get this down. Oops. Trying to dig out what we've planted. So we'll plant one more row here. 
So this will give us 50, 50 trees. Man, now that I've got 50, I want 100. Okay, I reckon a hundred would look good actually. That would be like another one. Oh yeah, okay, that's not going to work. I was going to just dig five holes across the front, but that won't work. All right, so now that that's up, we're going to go and start planting our cold area, which is up here. So I may need to, to flatten a little bit out and uh, increase a little bit, but this isn't going to be a tropical area anymore. So what we're going to do, as much as it kills me, we'll harvest these bananas. We're going to bring the plateau down to about here. So we'll start flattening that out. I might just grab my shovels and we'll put my shovels in a row. Is that all I've got on me? Right, yeah, we need to empty our pack. So basically, uh, we're going to flatten it to this area. So that means this area needs to be flat. Okay, so what I want is I want all of my shovels. Well, okay, while we're here, let's, let's move all of our apples out. The apples come from a tropical area to start with. Everything? Yeah, I think. Maybe. I'm doing is right clicking madly as we go through here. sure I missed a few. Pick up all of that. Go over the next row. Oops, there's another harvest that I missed. this row. So we could just sell all this fruit as is to John. like it. Let's pick it all up. I mean, you know, we have to plant a thousand more fruit. I'm not sure where I'm going to put that. Hello. Didn't I fill your bowls earlier, girls? Fine. Here, let me fill it again. There you go. Alright. Make sure I've got space. Yeah, I want to buy a few shovels. So what we might do is just offload everything we've dug up and cut down and harvested. Alrighty. 
I'm gonna try putting the um the sleeping bag over at Fletcher's in the in the store. Um, that. On. I forgot the poop into the seed bucket and the quandongs. Get off that. So quandongs and poop. Now we're looking good. We are so looking good. There we go. I know, I want to be able to put some of this furniture down as well. I just don't have the space yet. We should go and check with um, Thingamy. That over there. Right, that's all of that done. We need to go buy another food bowl too. But it's Wednesday, I wonder if he's open. We should check. Just grab that. That is annoying, that noise. Makes it a lot easier to harvest the bananas when the chicken cages aren't in the way. I know. Man, those condoms have shared their space, right? So we're going to make a ton of fruit salad out of this and a ton of, well, maybe not a ton, but a, a few uh, pavlovas and then we might see if we can make a profit. Um, I need to get a lot of metal out of the ground. Probably once we get um, our plantations down. I also want to go and get some coconuts because I haven't done that yet. And I, I have a feeling that the season's running. Yeah, look, it's the 18th of summer. We're over halfway through. So I think um, part of what we need to do... No, talk about fruit salad. Look at that. Yummy, yummy fruit salad indeed. Alright, so all of this is done. Alright, so we've got all of this. Okay. I don't, you know what, we definitely need the ability to distill fruit into alcohol. Or turn it into pies. We really, you know, can you imagine you can have a mega fruit pie with this? Awesome sauce. Right, now while we're here, let's pop our third miner's helmet in. Okay. Pop half of those in. And I will pop. Radio. So now we've got food waiting for us. We've got some cooked croco meat if we need it. We've got some keys. We've got some torches. I'm thinking that's that's a nice stash for our um for our going underground. It's like a going away party, but we haven't started the party yet. Right, the other thing I want to do is I want to bring my beehives into here and we might actually set them along this wall here. I think the chickens can cope. So I might just grab my beehive. Oh wow, yeah, let's not have that open. Alright, and I want to be able to put um, flowers all around them. So we're going to just switch these out. 
so I know how much space to leave. And grab my beehive so I know where it is. Radio. So what we're going to do is we're going to put, um, yeah, we're going to come out of here. And grab our Billy button. Oh, what are you doing? No, I did not mean to put you there. Yeah. I'm just going to grab this. I'm going to grab this. Radio. There we go. And I'm going to make like a little. I want to put one there so I know how far back and how far out. Actually, we'll just. Grab our bluebells, pop them down here. Grab our beehive. Alright, so you want the bees. Just want to turn that. There we go. So I'm going to actually be able to put flowers all the way around. So we're just going to get them their, their flowers from over here so they've got them. And we're going to drop those. I don't know if this actually affects their honey production, but um, we're going to give them love anyway with, with the flowers and put that around the beehives. We're going to put the beehives all in a row along that way so that they've got this massive row of beehives, this massive row of flowers. Oh, where's my bug book? I'm pretty sure I've got it on me. Plants, sleepies, bugs. Alright, so we know what that is. And we know what that is. It still sets my teeth on edge. Fly. I did say early morning. It may be possible I need to take my bug book for a run early in the morning. There it is. I, I do like having this book. I do. I have to admit, I have my doubts as to its worth, but um, even though I have to run around with my finger on the button, I can at least find the bugs now. I couldn't find them before. Well, I could, it was just harder. So we're just having a quick roam, completely off target. And what we're looking for are question mark bugs. Because those are the ones we don't have. I know, I think I've got to find a collar in the mines in order to be able to tame my dogger. So, um, I am going to leave it at home when I go out because I don't want it eaten. Because they're daft and they'll try and protect you. All right. Oh man, I was going to go and grab a shovel off John. <laughs> what? Let's let's head back and see if we can get back to John before he closes shop. We'll grab ourselves another shovel and then I'm going to go and see where I've put... Um... Yep. Alright, now I know where to go. I would have eventually gotten there, but I think it's just probably a little bit quicker and a little bit less nerve-wracking if I have a marker up on it that I can follow. Here we go. Hey John, I just came to buy a shovel before you closed up shop. Thank you. Yep, I'll take it. You're welcome. No, I should probably be building up um, pickaxes as well. Yep, I'll take that too. Uh, because we're going to need a few of them once we get going. Alrighty. I don't really want to do any more chores. Let's um, check in in here. A camo dress. I know, I'm going to leave that there. That, that looked exciting though. Whew. Is Milburn in? Milburn's still in his shop. Hey! Can you make me something? Sure, have a look. Hey, 
Okay, rattan cabinet went in. And bunk beds went in. Awesome. Wow, there are some very nice things in here. I'm running away before I spend a small or not so small fortune. Did it rain today? No, it did not. So we need to water our crops. So basically we've unlocked our big size sprinklers. Um, and before I put in more crops, man, this is not helping me, is it? Before I put in more crops, I want to see where I need to place my sprinklers so that I can um, maximize the usage of sprinklers and not have to do quite so much watering. By the same token though, I don't want to miss out on my uh, winter crops. I know, go figure, I want to have all the things. And I'm willing to work for it. Contrary to popular belief, nothing gets given to you that's worth having. I'm not sure, incredibly lucky, and then you need to look for strings. I know, here we go, the watermelon seed, a little bit of extra water and we're going to have to go fill our, our thing up again. I love the way these, um, these watermelon vines are designed, I really do. Makes perfect sense to me. Oh my gosh, look at this thing. As long as it doesn't try to eat me, I'm going to be happy. Uh, but I have to admit, I'm starting to get worried about that plant. It'd be nice if we could like consult Rain on what it might be. Um, take the seed to her and get her advice. That'd be kind of cool. That's all watered. Let's um let's fill our watering can up before we leave. There we go. Okay. Right, I need to find another 50 of those. So we're gonna go a little tree chopping spree. Got plenty of space to do it in. I forgot to drop my sleeping bag off at thingamies. some of that because we've already got the oh no, we don't have the extended well okay then Know. how many trees do we have to chop down oh well i'm actually going to chop down all of these because we want to um flatten out the land in this area so that we can um build like a, a fence so we can fence it in and provide the villagers with a little bit more of a safe zone oh, that's why i wanted to have like oh that's a beehive get that in a minute
I know someone's going to be mad at me for chopping down the trees, but we will plant them all back in because um, we're going to be wanting to put that in. Let's um, normal B. Where's the other one? Oh, normal B. Man, I was hoping. I was hoping. But it did not pay off. This, this will establish our hardwood plantation. Um... I think that was a bee and not a queen bee. I, I kind of didn't read it properly. Alrighty. I swear, I can hear more buzzing. Okay, it was a fly. It's alright, it was just so close to my bees that I, I couldn't be sure. Let's have a look. How many blackwood seeds have we got now? 30. So I, I need to chop down 10 more trees. And we'll have the 50 we need to plant to get our 100 in our grove. I know. Looking forward to it. And then we're going to plant both uh, those and the... Um, Make a big deal out of the uh, the thing. The gum trees. So those are the gum trees. And then we're going to have to go and get some more pine trees. But I think once we've got that, we should be right for timber. And uh, Oh, and I need palm trees. I need to get the coconut tree as well. So the wombats. We've got enough wombats for the moment. We've got enough pleat for the moment. Uh, we've got... I don't know. We've got enough chickens for the moment. Maybe. What time of day is it? Alrighty. How are we going for seed? I might just grab these seeds and pop them down here where I can see them. Uh, so we need we need a little bit more palm wood. We need a little bit more. We need some more bees. We definitely need more bees. So I'm hoping with all this chopping we're gonna find some more uh, queen bees. What I might do is mark out, um, okay, this is where I need my shovels. There's two, there's three, and we'll use, just switch these around. Alrighty. One. Well, that was annoying. That's really annoying. All right, let me. Oh no, that was that was okay. It's so one, two, three, four. Okay, so basically that's that's how, how wide our plantation is going to be. is going to be especially irritating. Oh, 
but it looks like things will jump to the side if you just keep with the shovel. That's annoying. Maybe I've got to empty my pocket, so it's just going to drive me completely crazy. So the trees are pretty when they're first planted; they're really hard to get past. But um, that's fine. It's ten thirty-eight. It's not quite midnight yet. Drop that in there. What can I drop off? I can drop off the poop. I can drop off the eggs. The apples. Quandongs and the limes go in here. All right, and the bananas. The bananas could go in the other one. I know we're we're moving ahead in leaps and bounds. We're just it's just taking us oops, a bit of time to to organize everything as we want. So we've got these beautiful waddle plantation. We've got this beautiful um, bottle brush plantation. We've got six wombats and they've got enough space in their enclosure now, so that's pretty good. Now we're just putting in our hardwood, put it giving back to the land some of what we've taken. Thanking it for taking care of us. that one in early then. Quite have our hundred, but we're getting really close to it. Can you imagine chopping all of these down at once? This is pretty much what we're going to have to do if we're going to find that queen bee. I mean, how many beehives is that that we've found and no queen bee? She is hard little bee to find. it's past midnight all right let's get the last seed in and then we're going to let this little character get some sleep beautiful it's all about the trees look at this so many so many let her go to sleep now i'm actually really pleased with with how things are working so um happy with that 
But on that note, guys, I'm going to bid you adieu. If you enjoyed this episode, please hit like. If you want to see more, please hit subscribe. And I'll check you later. Take care out there. Web farm. Nice. Alright, see you around, guys.